Hi, I'm Nick Quay, and this is Art Basel, Many Beach, 2016 in Aqua. And I'm here with a man from London who's a gallerist and also a physician. I am indeed, I am indeed, thank you. So, so which pieces do you like yeah. most here? Well, I think you already know that one. My favorite piece is behind him, the Queen of Spades. And I'm not really sure why, but as I was walking by a couple nights ago, something spoke to me, and it was that one. So it's a set of fours you'll see. And Queen of Spades is it. Tell us about the artist and yeah. the other artist you have. So this is Alan Magnum. He's a real cinephile. He loves anything to do with the cinema with the, and imagery that's mystical. And he thinks that when you take away the mysticism, it's, you're left, just left with narcissism. And he wow. wants to create d different ways of looking at things. He's got a picture, for instance, here with Lucy the Ball, where he tries to give her and make her the Amazonian. And he, tries, he does a lot of work with queens. And this was his new body of work, which he prepared specially here for Art Miami and Art Basel. So it's all about looking at things in a different way, trying to create that sensuality within it. But he's a pop surrealist, and that's his major genre, looking at challenging views. But always respectful, always creating a kind of slight cheekiness within it. Yeah, I'm looking around at all the other pieces in the room, and you can definitely feel like, like you can feel his energy and his passion and his level of respect for the artist that That's he's right. also portraying. That's right. Really like There's that. one other artist I really like to show you, if I may. Yeah, which sure. Is the guy down on the right there. Okay, let's see which one. Well, this is, uh, this is Ed he's a He's a modern day William Hogarth. He paints people for what they are, he, for all their depravity, all their beauty, their everyday activities. His attention to detail is tremendous. And he does it by sitting there for two or three weeks, making little sketches, and then takes that as a composite into one picture, which encompasses your vision and your view of what you've seen every time you visit here in this country, Coney Island, which is now really kind of a historical picture because of the features within it, the uh, Nathan's hot dogs, the roller coaster, the oh, parachute see. jump that doesn't work. But yet, at the same time, you'll see his attention to detail is incredible here with the cigarette, cigarette butts. And the people... Clams and beer and ice cream. I've actually been to Coney Island and I've seen these stands. And historically, this is even more special now because that is the Trump buildings. Really? So God save us. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about that one later. <laughs> That's another video. And here, of course, he's got another piece, which is his visit to uh, Japan, where he did Marinucci land. And again, the attention, the detail, the little bit of guys who are kissing and the signs on the tube that measure and say, please do this at home. <laughs> and in Japan, the, bit, the way you can create the sense of openness and negative space at the same time as the closeness is really what makes it outstanding and special. So between Magua and the pop surrealism and the modern day Hoga, we represent a huge selection of artists which are up and coming, well established, and I, you've got a keen eye. Cause Thank you. The so the one tell us where we can find the art, and is there a Facebook page or a gallery website? Where's the best place to contact you? The, the best place to contact us and these artists is through the gallery, GX Gallery. So GX um, Gallery is it on Facebook, it's, Instagram. It's, we have a Facebook account. We obviously, we have a website, gxgallery.com. So check out the link below. I'll post a link to his Facebook page and also to the website. Yeah. And we'll be good. Thank you so much for your time. My pleasure. Thank you. You really got to appreciate people like you that are bringing such beautiful art to Miami. Well, we like being here. It's been a wonderful place. And I am Miami. I am Miami. It's a lot. It's buzzing. You heard it from him. See you guys next year at Art Basel 2017.